Christian Universalism Series, number 18, Thomas Kissinger. So excited to be with you again. We're going to read a section from George Saris's book, Heaven's Doors. It's about Benjamin Rush. Some very interesting information. Benjamin Rush, 1745 to 1813, was a signer of the Declaration of Independence, a delegate to the Continental Congress, and a close friend of John Adams and Thomas Jefferson. In fact, it was Rush who reconciled the relationship between those two former presidents who had been political enemies for years by encouraging them to resume writing to each other. Rush was a practicing physician professor of medicine at the University of Pennsylvania and the founder of Dickinson College. He favored the abolition of slavery and was a pioneer in the study and treatment of mental illness, insisting that the insane had a right to be treated humanely and with dignity. He was also co-founder and vice president of the Philadelphia Bible Society. Rush was brought up as a Calvinist who focused on God's absolute power to accomplish his will. However, he was uncomfortable with the idea that God chooses to only save some, not all. He then studied Armenian theology, which taught that God desires to save all, but that he has given each person sovereignty over his own free will. Rush concluded that Calvinists were right about God's power and Armenians were right about his love. Here's his quote. The doctrine of universal salvation embraced and reconciled my ancient Calvinistical and my newly adopted Armenian principles. From that time, I have never doubted upon the subject of the salvation of all men. And here's the point, ladies and gentlemen. God is love. God is power. And also, let's say that God is wisdom and God has a plan for humanity through the Lord Jesus Christ to place all into Adam and then bring all into Christ and to reconcile all things through the precious blood of the Lord Jesus Christ. Take into consideration all the scriptures about the love of God. Also taking into consideration all the scriptures about the power of God. God is love. God is power. God is wisdom. God is the savior of the world in and through the Lord Jesus Christ. So who's right? Are the Calvinists right? Are those in the camp of Armenianism, right? Well, the Calvinists are right about the power of God, but they're wrong about the love of God. Those who embrace Armenianism are right about the love of God, but they don't understand the power of God. It's both. It's not about being a Calvinist or of the camp of Armenianism. It's about being a lover of truth. It's about knowing the truth and the truth will make you free. God is the savior of all mankind because he is love. He is power. He is wisdom. Hallelujah.